Hello. <laughs> Good morning. All right, I've got a new, I've moved my camera, so I'm hoping it, it looks okay. And I've got everything in shot. I think I have, even all my rubbish on the side. Yeah, so that's good. <laughs> it's not too rubbishy, is it? It's things. It's things. Things we need. We need lots of things. <laughs> well, I do. I'm trying, to, I'm trying to not have so many things. A squeaky chair. <laughs> squeaky chair, squeaky chair. Good morning, everyone. Um, I'm just having to um, watch my... Um, what's this? Ooh, it's meat being chopped up. It's a good advert to watch. About knives. Skip those ads. Okay, I can zoom in a bit because um, I, my setup is a bit um, closer. <laughs> a bit closer, so you should be able to see a bit better. I don't know. Let's see anyway. Let's see. <laughs> um, yeah. Good morning. I don't know if anyone's here. I think I'm just talking to myself at the minute. Oh well, it's been very hot here, and I've got my, my hair band around. I've just put one in. wondered where that had gone. It was on my wrist. Oh, and we were a bit, um, what do you call it today as well? Maybe it's the weather. A bit fuzzy. <laughs> but this is my sketchbook. Hi, Lisa. <laughs> yeah, I forgot it was Friday. I forget what I'm doing most of the time, but, you know. I hope my head's not going to like get in the shop a lot since I've moved this and my chair seems like extra squeaky this morning. <laughs> right, this is the sketchbook I'm using. Um, I hope it's clear as well because my microphone's like right in front of my face. It's sort of just, I don't know, it's just there. It's just out of shot. I don't know if you can see. Can you see it now? <laughs> it's sort of hanging there, this sort of like fluffy ball of stuff. I don't know why it's so um, jumpy jumpy. I hope it's not for everybody. I'm not, I'm not sure why. Anyway, this is the sketchbook <laughs> I'm using. You can read it um, if you want to find out what it is. It is a C White sketchbook and it's mixed media paper, not watercolour. Um, this is, I don't know why it's so laggy. It's laggy today for some reason. There must be a lot of people on. Um, the internet or something <laughs> or YouTube's not playing very well this morning hope it doesn't disappear altogether anyway this is um yeah this is what <laughs> we've painted so far well I've painted in, in, and you've watched me and hopefully some people have joined in <laughs> oh, it's so fuzzy I'm not sure whether it's just me I hope everyone else has got a clear picture it might it corrects itself sometimes after a little while anyway this morning we're going to paint agapanthus i was just out in my garden admiring the beautiful ones ow it's not paper cut now <laughs> so yeah let me show you on my um hopefully you'll be able to see these are agapanthuses that's not an agapanthus i've just done a skillshare class guys so um yeah it's weird isn't it I don't know why. I don't know why it's doing that. I'm just going to move my, um, oh gosh, I can't move it down there anymore. I was just going to move it so you didn't keep getting my head. <laughs> oh, I'm not really a bit like that for now. Anyway, yeah, it's really pixelated. I'm sorry, it's not nothing to do with me. Normally it's, it's fine. It must be the hot weather. I can't cope with being hot. <laughs> well, there's like a million people on YouTube. <laughs> live streaming at this moment yeah this is my Skillshare class I did so um, if you're on Skillshare I have got a link somewhere for free a couple of months or something I will sort it out and I will put it in my um, thing what do you call it the description or somewhere on the page so this is my agapanthus in the garden they're so beautiful I don't think I've ever painted them before because they're quite daunting but then I'm thinking if I can paint Queen Anne's lace in that I'm, I'm just like Got a bit um, up on this knee this morning. Yeah, <laughs> yeah so uh, I don't know. I've got a bit scared of them. <laughs> I can blow a scared. Hi, Shirley. <laughs> good morning, good morning. Good 
good morning. Right, I should stick that there for, for my inspiration to try. Now, I was, um, <laughs> this is what's left over from my skill shape class. I've put far too much paint on my um, palette, as I always do, because I like to have a lot of paint. Now, I need a pinky colour or a purpley colour to um, make that blue. So I'm just going to stick that in there. So I'm using this. And the colours that are in here, I've got paper cut. <laughs> oh no, Lisa, I've got loads. Mine, mine have like flourished this year. Um, I've got Luna Black, um, this one, uh, Cobalt Turquoise by Mission. It's still not very clear, is it? It's just uh, it's getting better. <laughs> and I've got Quinacridone Gold by Jackson's Art. Oh, and I think I slapped a bit of Sleeping Beauty in there as well, because I've got it out. And that one must be Daniel Smith Phalo Blue. I don't know how to say that. And the one I just squirted in there is Cobalt Violet, which I love. Anyway, <clears throat> let's just put that there and start painting. <laughs> so I haven't got many colours and the brush I'm using, so I'll have to go through all this because I always get asked, <laughs> is a faux squirrel by Zen Art. Is that the one? I don't know what else it says. It's a number 10 round. God, that really stings my paper cut. <laughs> Hi Charlie. <laughs> Hi everybody. Hi everyone that's watching. I know it's a bit pixelated this morning for some reason. I've got no idea why. It is not me. <laughs> it is not my connection. It's obviously something to do with YouTube and the amount of people who are live streaming or doing whatever or something's just gone wrong in the eth, eth what do you call it, ether. <laughs> well, that's not, the cobalt violet is not violeting. I always find cobalt violet a weird colour. It does not like to mix well. Anyway, I've got a really like this bright blue and this blue and that blue and black and I'm gonna, I'm scared <laughs> that I'm putting off painting them. I've never painted these before, so um, oh, well that's completely the wrong colour. They're more of a purpley. I'm gonna have to. I'm not happy. I'm not happy with that colour, so I'm gonna have to put in. I'm gonna put some amethyst genuine, but this is quite dark. I want like a bright purple. Let's get a little bright purple in colour. No, I haven't. I'm going to have to resort to my other. I know what I want this one. This is the colour here. See, I've got it in this palette. I was trying to just use up this. So let me just stick it in. There. Then I can use my purples, which are down here. Which is a mixture of all the purples in the world that I have. Well, it's not all the purples in the world, is it? It's just the ones I've got. Let's <laughs> mix it. They need to be purplier. I don't know. I can't get the colour right. Oh, no, it's not lagging now. It's cool. It's going it's to come all nice. <laughs> right, I'm doing the buds. They're purplier. They're still purplier than that. But they are different colours. I've got a white one coming up now as well. It's in with the um, the others. That's better. That's the colour. They are more purple. Steve said they were purple the other day. And I went, oh no, they're blue. And then I looked at them and I went, yeah, they are purple. <laughs> or mauve or whatever. Hello, Liana. Hello, 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 hello. Hello, hello. Ooh. That, that, I don't know what that is, don't ask me, it's just something, I'm just sort of doing it from this picture. I've got paint painting agapanthus in a weird way, it's weird, it's because there's so many um, flower heads at all different angles, I'm trying to get like some of these are like open up. I don't know how many petals they've got. They seem to have quite a lot. But then you've got to get the middles of them that are coming out. I don't know if I'm in a purple pencil as well. Look at that. Maybe this is going to help me. That's better. Sometimes 
get the draw stuff. <laughs> I'm still laggy again. I don't know what's wrong with the tube this morning. It's um, it's not playing very well. It doesn't want to play today. It feels a bit like me. I didn't want to play it today either. I was a bit tired. <laughs> I think it's because I spent spent all day yesterday filming and editing. Do you want to see what I did for my Skillshare class? You've probably seen these before, but I thought <laughs> I think I did it as a live. And now I've turned it into a Skillshare class. I painted. <laughs> we'll just forget about what I'm doing there for a minute. <laughs> so I painted dragonflies. So if you want to learn how to paint these, then they were just sort of copies that I did. Um, I've got in a Skillshare class. And it's all detailed. It's not like a live one of my lives, it's more of a more um, formal approach <laughs> where I have to describe everything I'm doing and the reasons behind it and things like that. Whereas if you catch me live, you don't get the whole list of supplies and things I just wing it. <laughs> right, let's stick some more and Cyril's come to say hello. What are you doing? Cyril is doing his yoga. Doing his downward dog. I think this is looking a bit like... When I put the stems in, I think it would probably look more like an agapeltis. I don't know why. I've been so worried about painting these. I keep looking at them and thinking how pretty they are. It would be nice to... No, they won't be nice to paint. <laughs> That's right. <laughs> They're too... Um, you'll get all the details in. Let's put some... I don't know. Whether, they've got so many like flowers on their head. Uh, if I, if I can paint a these what are they hydrangeas with all those flower heads, I can surely paint the Nagapanthus. Oh no, Charlie, that's sad. I um last was it last year? Yeah, last. Oh no, in the spring. One of my agapanthus was flowering. It, it sort of had a, I don't know what's wrong with it. <laughs> it obviously got confused. I had one flower and it, but it was tucked away in the corner and I thought they'd all sort of died because um, they were really pot bound, but they like being pot bound. And um, I did thin them out. And then um, I think the thinning out of them has done them a world of good, actually. And now they're like fantastical. It even splits them more up. See, that looks like an agapanth, doesn't it? I don't know what I was so worried about. There you go. <laughs> the head's on. It's got a bigger head on it. To... Oh, I don't know. Let's draw another one. <laughs> don't know. It's still a bit fuzzy, isn't it? I don't know what's wrong with it this morning. If you watch the replay, they sort it out in the um, uploading thing, so um, you can watch the replay and it won't be as fuzzy wuzzy, if you know what I mean. <laughs> I keep thinking of that, that rhyme, fuzzy wuzzy was a bear, fuzzy wuzzy had no hair, fuzzy wuzzy something, okay, I can't remember the rest of it, but you know. <laughs> Sorry, um, I'm a bit... Um, talking nonsense today. <laughs> yeah, my, why is my Penelope van goes today? The sad times. Yeah, I think the heat's got to YouTube. Yeah, my VW, it was supposed to be picked up yesterday, but he rang and said he couldn't do it because, um, I don't know, being called out on a pickup or something <laughs> for an accident accidental and um so they didn't come and get it so she's still here and i'm thinking oh i don't want to sell her now she's gone but she's sold and it's all sorted and it's, she's definitely going today mm. and I, I i'm in mixed emotions about it because i did really want to do her up 
poor VW. I had so much fun in it, though. I've, and she's given me years of fun. And I've got my little what's it van. He needs a little bit of work doing to it. So the money that I've got from Penelope is going to give more life to them. My what's it van. Which I will be out in in a few weeks' time at Linda's Farm Festival. <laughs> so the only festival I've done this year. That proper festival. It's still really fuzzy, isn't it? It must be the heat. It, it can't cope. I think last time it was really hot, it had a bit of trouble with the... What do you call it? It makes all the... What does it say? <laughs> On the weather warning, it says things go weird. Oh, I don't know. It makes me go weird. Right, that's that one. I can't get the shadows. Look how steady my hand is. <laughs> oh, that's great, Lisa. Yeah, I used to go to the um, one at Malvern, Malvern, Malvern Hills, the Malvern Hills. Yeah, um, which was um, Dubfest. Is it Dubfest? There's something like that. Oh, I don't know. VW Fest. We saw or something. Because <laughs> my brother's still got his um, van. His van's really beautiful. He spends so much money on it though. It's ridiculous. I haven't used my bleach. I'm going to use a bit of bleach on this one. Just to um, do the middles. This is looking not bad, is it? <laughs> I don't know why I get so worried about painting things. And I, I tell other people not be worry just go in ahead and do it yeah myself <laughs> I get now I've got the shape of it it's okay I'm gonna be painting these all the time now stupid <laughs> Oh, cool, Lisa. Yeah, I've done mine. Yeah, I've done. I did enjoy mine, but the, you need if you're there, the classic ones like mine's like from 1980, so it's now um, MOT and um, tax exempt and classed as the classic car. But they need, always need so much work. The amount of money I spent on it just whilst it was. They're not known to have been the most reliable. <laughs> and you need to be able to afford to keep it going. Because um, what happened to mine was I couldn't afford to get it um, through the... Um, well, I did would have got it through the MAT, but I moved. And I met this man. <laughs> you know, the man. And um, he was a VW restorer and he was supposed to do the bit of welding that it needed to get it through the MOT because he was a welder and a VW restorer and he kept saying no I'll do it don't you take it anywhere I'll do it I'll get it going um yeah it sat there for six years then he bought me another one in the place of it because he said he can't do it because it's too much work. It's just like you're gonna have to like take it to bits. <laughs> so, um, but then, but then after everything that happened, he took it back. <laughs> so then I was left with my one. But if I was like still in Sussex and still didn't meet this guy, she'd probably still be running. Which is something I regret. I shouldn't have. Don't ever listen to a man, guys. <laughs> there, forewarned. Put a bit of shadow here.
Oh yeah, MGs are, are a bit low. I had a red MG. It had a um. It was. I love that car. <laughs> and then I had an accident on a roundabout with a um a massive lorry. I was like the woman behind me said I looked like a ping pong ball between the, the um, uh, central reservation and the lorry wheels. <laughs> it was a bit scary, but. I was okay. Everything was good. <laughs> Let's do like a bud one. I don't know. Let's do one sort of coming up here. Then I can see like there's a bud one. <laughs> Hi Sherry. Hi Rosalie. Hi. Who who else have I missed? <laughs> hello, hello, hello. This is a bud, by the way. So it's not going to be open. Green. I'm using the colours that I use for my Skillshare class, so the colours are a bit weird, but I just want to use them up. They sort of like curl up a bit like the um, Queen Anne's lace, and then they have the bit that covers the. There's a special word, Charlie. Do you know what it is? <laughs> for the, um, the covering of the bud. <laughs> and then when the flower opens, the, the, they die, don't they? The, the leaves that encase the bud of the flower. I don't know, something like that. <laughs> I do know, but I'm just terrible at remembering things lately. It's just like, what's wrong with me? I, I couldn't think what these were called, the egg this morning. I had to look it up. I was like, can do they? And I kept calling them anthorhinums, and I was thinking, no. So I had to Google it, and anthorhinums came up. Like, no, anthorhinums are snapdragons, <laughs> not agapanthus. Well, I've been saying it all day the other day. Yes, that's right. The se se sepals, sepals. <laughs> that's what I said. I asked the same question the other day, didn't I? Oh my God, my, my brain. <laughs> Oh, I've still got my paper cut off of this. It's really stinging. <laughs> what is it about paper cuts? It's awful. But it's still not very clear, is it? I'm, I'm very um, sad about that. But yeah, there's the bud. Let's do another bud. There's buds that are more um, closed up. There is it. it seems to be the, the white ones that I've got that are more, uh, that haven't come out yet. But the... Um, But the blue ones, purple ones, are actually out and quite looking quite cool. I'm just doing it from the back. Add a bit of darkness. There. work did it? It was supposed to be like a yeah there we go. <laughs> anyway I think I sort of um oh look it's gone clear now. <laughs> I think I I don't know why I was so worried about painting that. This that flower looks quite cool though, actually. I don't know what's wrong with me. Why did I worry so much about painting it? It's always the way that it? you worry about doing something and then when you actually do it it's not as bad as you think. As with most things in life. I'm just using this pencil crayon to um, do a little bit of details. Yeah, I don't know why I was so nervous, Lisa. <laughs> there we go. It was the um, the melt of uh, flower heads. So I like just painting like one flower, but because this, but then, like I said, because I could paint the hydrangea, it was fine. <laughs> Wasn't the problem, but there we go. Painted. My first agapanthus painting. <laughs> Yay! That's all right, isn't it? I'm quite happy with that. That would do. <laughs>
I do like painting in my sketchbook and uh, another reason why I like it is because um, it doesn't matter if you mess up but I haven't really messed up so far although that's a bit of a I don't know what this one was <laughs> um, I quite like those roses except for that one that should not be there I just need to paint over that <laughs> But it's a sketchbook, so it doesn't matter. And this one was quite a fun one to do. And they were nice to do. I was, I was nervous about painting these ages ago as well. But now I've conquered, conquered the agapanthus sphere. <laughs> anyway, thank you for joining me, everybody. It's another quick one this morning. Well, this is about half an hour, isn't it? Yeah, that would work. Please give us a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And also go and check out my new Skillshare class <laughs> and you can paint, paint these I should you know paint them anyway thank you very much hi Joan goodbye Joan <laughs> I'm going <laughs> thank you for joining me have a great weekend everybody I'm going to enjoy the nice hot weather it's a bit too hot yesterday though but I'm going to enjoy, <laughs> enjoy the nice hot weather I, look, I can stand up and actually see now I've made my camera a bit lower <laughs> Anyway, thank you for joining me and I will see you on Monday. Bye.